Welcome back, man and woman of God. Thank you for making it worship unveiled Mamlaka Television. It's such a blessing that you have allowed to, 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 to just sit and learn from uh, uh, our program, and we are so, so grateful. We have got mambo ya choice of songs. Yes, yes. Na jameni in a waka moto. I've come to realize it's deeper than I thought. Yes, yes. And I've loved to make kuja tukafika kuna mali umetaja levels. Yes, levels. And you are make, making an example, a very good example, mm -hmm. that I would love you to pick it from there. Yes, yes. Yeah, umesema kuna levels on how to decorate God. Mm -hmm. Not just God, even yes. your own, the wale watu mnaongea na wow. Yes, yes. Kuna mahali unezo ongea style flan. Yes, yes. Na mkifika in a private or a more intimate place. Yes. Unabadilisha your dialect. You yes. Know? And actually, I've, 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 I've just remembered the verse tumesoma. Sure. Because we were talking about spiritual songs. Mm -hmm. Bible in Asema, you will sing Psalms. Mm -hmm. And then from Psalms, that's the first level. Yes, yes. From Psalms, hymns. Hymns. And then the last level is spiritual songs. Spiritual songs. songs. Meaning, to get on a spiritual song, mm -hmm. we are going to fail. According to how you're, you're explaining it, so there yes, are yes, levels. Yes, yes. You begin, Willow Mesema, E Psalms. You start with Psalms, as the Bible says, I will enter his gates yes. with thanksgiving. That's the first level. Yes, yes. That's yes. beginning with Psalms. Yes, yes. And then you go to hymns. And then lastly, spiritual mm -hmm. songs. Please elaborate more on the levels. Yes, yes. Now, we, we started by saying that uh, worship is a deliberate intention to decorate God. So, what we need to understand is that any song that is not decorating God is not a worship song. Mm. Any song that is not <laughs> decorating God for who He is, mm -hmm. we may say He's beautiful. You are the Lion of Judah. We are decorating Him. Mm -hmm. You are the mighty man of war. Mm -hmm. You know, uh, we give you all the glory. Mm -hmm. You deserve all the honor. We are decorating Him. Mm -hmm. Now, when, when, when we come now to a song, like, uh, like for example, and all these songs, by the way, they should be right scripturally. They should be based on the word of God. You understand? I do. Because if they are not based on the word of God, they will be seasonal. Mm. Now, if we are decorating God, and we talked of levels, we can decorate him like I gave you an example. We mm. can decorate him as we enter to Napofika sitting room. By the time to the bedroom, now that is intimacy with God. That's right. Worship. That's right. Intimacy. Now, that's where you find what walifika mahali mpaka sasa kuna mutu wa melala chini. Mm-hmm. Siju kama usha yona ukianza worship, diyo tunaanza song ya kwanza watu wa melala chini. Have you ever seen that? Very rare, very rare. It's very rare. It cannot happen because mm -hmm. those people unawapeleka two in levels. And that's, that's right. why I said, as a worship leader, you should be very careful not to lose these people on the way. Walk with them. Walk with them. By the time unafika mahali, ushafika kwa ibada unapata, this, this program is not, you cannot control it yourself. Hata ukinyamaza people walienda. That's right. Because those people, you walked with them, you walked with them. Sasa uluwafikisha mahali kwa intimacy, they don't want to get out of that place. That is why it is very important. And maybe because you are very sensitive to understand the Holy Spirit song. And you dwelt there. By the way, it is not about the number of songs that you sing in a worship service. No. That makes a worship service effective. No. It is the Holy Spirit song. You can pick just one song and sing it for two hours and people will just want to dwell there because you have taken them to that place because you have built on that song from sitting room like i said to the bedroom now how what wako hapo how attack kutoka hapo now it has reached to that intimacy level when i say i surrender everything those people mutu akisema hivo he means it from their heart i give it all to you now that is intimacy mm. But sometimes we sing it just because it is a song. Mm -hmm. But if you level sasa ya intimacy, you have worked with those people who may have a level ya intimacy. Mm -hmm. And the Holy Spirit now is ministering to them. That service you cannot control. Mm -hmm. That is why it is very important to understand the choice of songs that you want. Mm -hmm. Don't lose people by mixing the themes. No. Because mutu, unampeleka kumwambia mungu sasa, ni asante. Then all of a sudden, ume, 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 ume murudisha sasa kusema, how beautiful is your name? 
before amujaenda aenda sana umemwambia mighty warrior jehovah is your name you know now somebody who is very sensitive will understand hapo tuna kuna mahali tunapigishwa kon mm. rafanya dj only eh, dj <laughs> ni mixing <Yeah. laughs> ni spiritual song mixing very important yeah. and people should understand that it is not about this the, the number, number of songs, of songs. No. we are not in a competition of how many songs you can sing within that minute mm. even that those 30 minutes one song is enough mm. two songs are enough oh my if the holy spirit picks a song and he wants you to dwell there don't be quick to move mm -hmm. stay there that is what the holy spirit wants to minister to people with very important mm. yes so what you're saying is mm -hmm. that a worship leader should be very very open minded to the spirit of god very open minded because reza come a playlist mm -hmm. seven songs yes umefika mm -hmm. and the holy ghost wants you to build on there yes yes kuna mtu atakwazika for example if you have a band leader mm -hmm. kama kama for example I'm an md at my yes, church yes. and i really love protocol umefika mm -hmm. tatu and then the holy ghost ameachi hapo hapo ndo nataka build on yes yes hizi nyimbo zingine ine eh what 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 how, how do you think that can affect a praise and worship team now who was the leader in the first place sorry who was the leader let's say you you are the one who came up with the playlist uh -huh. not the worship team wow you get it mm -hmm. it's you who took time maybe to pray so, and to prepare mm -hmm. okay we are, mm -hmm. we are raising yes yes i'm saying this because experientially yes yes i have some people at, back at my church yes we have a growing church mm. and i have a, a, a group of people ambao yes you have to advise them you have yes. to sh give them an example mm -hmm. sing this and this other song you're raising them to yes, be yes, worship yes, leaders, yes, yes, eh? yes how 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 do you think it's going to affect the way we are relating mm -hmm. let's say for example unajua kuna watu sasa hizi muziki na grow yes yes kuna mtu kama vile our brother max ameka hapa na mic unapata yeye ndo md we have trained tumesema playlist ni nyimbo 14 yes yes na anajua in fact mbaka anajua after we sing this for 3 minutes yes. ataanza ku play the tune to the next song don't you think that is going to bring chaos more than flow your holy spirit now i believe the reason you are called the worship leader of that time not not the team leader eh? per se the worship leader of that service is because all of us we are supposed to follow you as you follow the holy spirit even the band the bgvs we are supposed to follow you so yes ina, yes ina, ina ishia kwa practice yes yes because now at that time we when they to me pair uh steering that's powerful no no if for example you are driving a car alafu wewe uko hapa kwa driver sasa usikiange na huko kila mtu sasa anakuambia ni wakati wa kuweka gear 4 huyo mwingine na huko anakuambia hapana si gear 4 ni gear number 2 we will confuse you that's right mwingine anasema overtake no you are not safe to overtake you know mtapata ajali ambayo mtapata ajali but because we have given you the steering every team should understand that the person on the mic the person on the lead that day all of us we should follow them as they follow the holy spirit so that we avoid a lot of confusions now for those people who are being raised maybe you told them yakomba eh, why don't you lead this and this song mm -hmm. i believe them too are supposed to be prayerful come on are supposed to be filled with the holy I hope, spirit i hope they're hearing me yes please listen to mbugwa gk yes they are supposed to be prayerful prayerful they are supposed to have prepared even though you give them the song they go they went back and prepared with the same song that you gave them as they listen to the holy spirit on what he wants you see and also they should be learned uh, 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 learned and uh, they should be taught ya kwamba kuna kitu inaitangwa holy spirit song we, sh we are not doing our songs let them understand i gave you these songs i like that but it is possible kwa hizi songs hatutazifanya zote i like that you see the holy spirit may decide to, to to pick a song here if it happens to be so please be free to do it mm -hmm. we don't have to do all the songs that i have given you follow the holy spirit we will follow you so what you're saying man of god is that you're calling every worshiper to be prayerful, prayerful. personally you cannot how can you be a worshiper without being prayerful personally wewe mwenyewe unahitaji kuwa unahitaji kuwa 
filled with the Holy Spirit alone. Yes, yes. Unahitaji kuwa prepared alone. Yes, yes. Unahitaji kuwa uko prayed up alone. Yes, yes. That even when we come with our ideas, yes. You you are open minded to the spirit of God. Yes, yes. That's number one. You, Second, you, yes. yes. Secondly, yes. You have said something very powerful. Mm -hmm. Worship leaders ndo wanakuanga na staring. Ndio wako na staring at that time. Oh my god. They are, they are the one leading us. Yes, yes. So sisi wengine wote. Yes. I know sp we are speaking to teams yes. that are listening to us. Na kuna keyboardists na drummers mm. ambao jameni ama MDs yes. for that matter ambao they feel more equipped than yes. the worship leader. Yes. They feel yes. more skilled than mm. the worship leader. There is something the man of God has said ya kwamba this is not about your team. Mm. This is about what the spirit wants. Yes, yes. This is not about how skilled you can do, mm. how many it's not about the number of songs. It's not about the number of songs. It's about the songs that God wants to hear. Yes. And and the timely songs. Mm. So this is a very beautiful advice for everyone under the power of our voice. Yes. That you need to be open minded as well. As a team, we are working as a team. Yes. The worship leader mwenye ameshika mic yeye ndo ana 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 nini yeye ndo ana yeye ndo ana kwa usukani that type yeye ndo ako na staring tukikupea wewe utatuongoza siku yako unataka. yes yes but you see you say like the you, you you say something like the band may decide to to, to play something wewe ukiwafuata there might be confusion because these people That's might right. be playing something that they practiced yesterday na wakasikia inaingiana vizuri so they are doing something that is exciting them, to them. Mm -hmm. yes so they should follow you And, and, that's, and that's why there should be communication between them and you so that if you want to change a song they know that's why there is the, the, the importance of rehearsals so that uh, there is a way we can communicate even in the team and the members will not know what we are doing i can tell you now we are we are starting the song from the top let's dwell on the chorus The band will know they understand because you have practiced together unawaambia nikifanya hivi hivi ndio tunafaa kufanya mm. if i want us to go to the next song i will signal them mm -hmm. if i haven't signaled them stay there mm. because i'm on the steering that yes. time oh my god so nobody should should move ahead of the mm. of the of the leader of that day mm. ama usikie mtu mwingine anaanza kuimba kawimbo kake na hapo nyuma how would you take it the bgvs kwa sababu kuna kawimbo kana mbariki sasa na yeye aanze kuongoza kake that, na hapo that, that, that actually sounds competitive <laughs> yes mm. and there will be confusion yeah. and because the spirit of god is not the spirit of confusion mm. and he respects order because that time ni wewe umepewa hiyo authority be sure the holy spirit will use you at that time jameni my fellow band members tunyenyeke <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I feel I feel challenged honestly. Yes. I, I am I'm a culprit, a very huge one. Yes. Who predict songs. Uh -huh. When I'm playing the keyboard, yes. I love predicting songs. Yes, yes. But now that with that understanding and that's yes. why Worship Unveiled is a very powerful program. Sure. Because we are learning we 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 don't want to do things that pleases personal attitude bamba to CC. Yes. We want to do things that pleases God. Yes. And if God is pleased with teamwork, we are supposed to be humble so mm. my fellow band members ambao mnaniskia najua kuna wengi mmekasirika sahi yeah. but this is my advice and this is the prayer ambayo utatuombea pia that god and other to nyenyekesha we work as a team you have mentioned Very something important. about communication yes ambayo i would love us to dwell in before we go for a break mm -hmm. ku communicate mm -hmm. na band yes yes ku communicate na the team yes how how how, how do you advise how How do I do such? How do I communicate? Niko hapo na lead ni mzama I'm supposed to listen to the Holy Spirit. Yes. Again I'm supposed to communicate. I'm supposed to know that kuna pastors ambao jamani they love throwing signals. Okay kama zabao. Yes, yes. How do you multitask? How do you do that as a worship leader? Now, communication is is it can be different from one team to the another. Okay. Depending on how you you Venye mmejuana. Venye mmejuana. Mm -hmm. You see If you go to every profession but do you know that do you know in a medical field tunaweza kukusengenya bila wewe kujua Usiseme Because there are terms we can use na kumbe tunakuzungumzia na how do you Unaona vitu Unaona Uende kwa accounting uende kwa media there is some language they can use na waongee kuhusu jambo na usishikanishe Na wananisengenya Yes na wanakusengenya ama they are talking to something Eh <laughs> Juzi nilipanda matatu ingine. 
conductor na driver walikuwa wanapiga story mimi si kuelewa kitu hata moja siji kama wanaita slam na, lakini nasikia ni, 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 ni story imeshika na ni tamu but ushiki kitu mpaka mama mmoja akawaambia ningependa kujua hiyo lugha <laughs> eh because hiyo tunaweza ongelelea mtu na hasijue mm-hmm. now the same thing happens when you spend time together as a team number one, you will be able to know how to tell maybe if you have a band yenye iko na vyombo mingi maybe you have a lead keyboardist mm-hmm. you are able to communicate to communicate mm-hmm. here we are going hard we are going soft now uh, stop the bgv stop you know without even others knowing mm-hmm. na hawa wengine hawatajua hawa ataona tu vitu zina flow kumbe kuna communications zinakuja hapo so what you saying yes ni kwamba hata kama unasikiza roho mtakatifu yes rehearsals na kujuana na team ni important you cannot substitute preparation at you seme tu unakuja kwa neema preparation i like yes. that prayer and preparation is key you cannot substitute that tukiamka hapa asubuhi tuseme tuseme sasa eh, tunaongoza ibada wewe utatuongoza na hatuku prepare yesterday you will definitely know that's right because we have not spent time together utapata tunajaribu kuimba sasa hiyo ndio tunajaribu kuweka ki ah wewe mtu wa keyboard umeenda juu sana teremka wewe uko loud sana you know but if you have spent time together to prepare people will definitely know man of god unajua kuna kongana na ka issue mm-hmm. i've had this ya kwamba watu hawapendi ku practice worship yes session. yes yes nasimanga wacha roho mtakatifu atutawale yes But according to how I'm listening to you right now you're saying it's equally important very important for the sake of harmony yes and and very good uh, uh, to avoid confusion to avoid know? confusion so your advice for praise and worship teams they don't just pray they also practice they also practice you see even spending time together in rehearsal it makes your heart to unite that's right you are not strangers because you can be in a team with strangers that's right now when we are not strangers we are now fellowship we are we are we are in a fellowship we are co-workers we understand each other so well even without without a lot that we have done our hearts are tied together you see you have found yourself like uh, like for example uh kuna mahali unaweza kuhudumu unasikia kuna ugumu fulani kuna ugumu fulani because maybe those people you you, you are not hamujaunganishwa pamoja yeah. you are not together yeah. spiritually you are not in agreement mm-hmm. you see now rehearsing and preparation and spending time together it brings us together in the spirit mm-hmm. inatoa hiyo mngengano inatoa mabishano na inawaelekeza macho yenu kwa kitu kimoja that's right such that you are able to understand each other even without you do you know you can communicate even in silence it's possible because you have been mejuana yes bila mumejuana kama ni kama umenikumbusha mama mm-hmm. yangu alikuwa ananiambia niende ni hesabu wageni na yes. usijue yes yes kuna sasa zingine maybe tulikuwa tunakula chapati eh hey. nikachukua chapati ya pili <laughs> Kuna vile mama wangu ataniangalia. Anaangalia unajua hapo hapo kuna communication makosa imefanyika. <laughs> This and more is 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 really coming to you at the comfort of your home here at Mamlaka TV. Don't pull don't don't pull out. This talk is ai gonja. We are having our last segment coming in. We'll be right back after the break.